Easy Ice Cream Sandwich Valentine Hearts. Let's see what's cooking. Let's get the facts. Let's see what's cooking. It's time for yo yo max 12. Hello everyone, starting off with ice cream sandwiches. Try to find the largest ones you can. Um, my grocery store didn't have much of a variety. I had these small ones. Then you're just going to cut out hearts using a heart-shaped cookie cutter. And of course, the larger the sandwich, the more choices you have for the size of cookie cutter. So I just lined up the little heart-shaped cookie cutter and just pressed down to cut out the heart shape. Now do this when they are nicely frozen. If they're too soft, the ice cream is just going to want to squish out between the wafers. And then just push it out through the cookie cutter and you have a little little heart and then uh, this particular ice cream sandwich I was able to get two of the larger hearts out of it and then I was able to get a smaller heart with that remaining piece and one of the best parts of this craft if you want to call it that this edible craft is that you get to eat scrap pieces and here's a little one and if you have any kid helpers I'm sure they'll be able to help you with getting rid of those scraps and then a little one now you can just use them just the way they are, or you can put them on little sticks. I thought these were really cute as a little ice cream sandwich pop. So I put little popsicle sticks in the middle, then put them in the freezer and make sure they get nice and frozen solid. And then all you have to do is take them out, dip them into some sprinkles, the, the ice cream edge into some sprinkles, and then put them in the freezer until you're ready to serve them. Another option that I tried is to use this Hershey's chocolate shell. It's this liquid chocolate stuff you put on ice cream and it hardens instantly. You can dip your ice cream sandwich hearts into that chocolate shell, let the, the excess drip off, and then quickly before it hardens onto the ice cream sandwich heart, sprinkle with a little bit of Valentine's Day themed sprinkles, and then put them on some wax paper and in the freezer to set. And there they are completed. Now you'll notice that ice cream sandwiches have these little holes in the wafer part. And as I was making these, some of the little tiny round sprinkles were falling into the holes kind of randomly. And I thought, well, that looks really cute. So I just sprinkled some of the round ones on top and they fell into the little holes and I think it makes them look extra cute. These are quick and easy little Valentine's Day treat. Doesn't take any time at all, and I think anyone who tries these are going to love them. Now I have an entire playlist on my channel of Valentine's Day treats, some of which are also quick and easy to make, and you can make them last minute if you're looking for something. So I hope you give these a try, and thank you for watching.